What's poppin', ladies and gentlemen? Today we are back for episode number four of our Pokemon Sapphire Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. If you guys are hype, if you are excited, make sure you leave a like, make sure that you comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. If you missed out on last episode, we got some pretty cool Pokemon. We lost a Pokemon. Sadness. We also missed out on an encounter. Sadness. But we caught two really cool Pokemon, so if you missed out, make sure you go check that out. We also beat Roxanne, and uh, yeah, we saved Pico, and we got to Duford Town, and now we are set to uh, hand Steven Stone this very important letter, as well as take on the gym. So, we're going to head up there and uh, hand Steven Stone our letter. We're going to go find him. Wait, there's items. I got to battle this guy first. There's items. Okay, then. Um, speaking of sadness, <laughs> immediately... We, we find the sadness, the source of sadness itself. Anyway, I'm going to go into Tinkerbell here. Uh, quick attacks. not Yeah, okay. We're fine. That's going to do a lot. So, All right, so we're going to be able to kill this thing with uh, with Tinkerbell. Sceptile, why does he have so... Wh I'm confused. I am just going to stay in. Yeah, we're good. That was scary. Uh, I don't know why this, thing has, why this guy has a Sceptile, but please don't have that ever again. Uh, I'm just going to Water Pulse this and kill it, and uh, Confirm gets level 14. We're getting levels. We're a little under-leveled, I think, but we've got some power. Are you kidding me? That's another one. We've got two now. That's insanity. There's, isn't there an item here? Super Potion. Nice. That's actually helpful. All right, cool. So we're going to go in here, get our first encounter, and uh, this guy gives us Flash, right? Yeah, but I don't actually need Flash. I know my way around this place like the back of my hand, you know? Alright, so we're going to walk in here until we get our first encounter. Can we get this Pokeball first? A Revival Herb. Useless, thanks. Right, I guess we're going to find our encounter in the dark. I actually don't know why around this place. So, uh, I'm probably going to get lost. Our first encounter, however, is going to be a Yanma. A Yanma it is. So, uh, I think I can find with this thing, yeah, a million times. As long as he doesn't have... Like Bug Buzz or something. I don't actually know. He, I don't think he can actually hurt me. So I'm going to put him to sleep. Vine Whip again a couple of times. Yanma, I don't think, is going to make its way onto the team. However, uh, it's a cool Pokemon. Uh, if if Yan Mega was in the game, I think it would definitely make its way onto our team. However, Yan Mega is Gen 4. So Yanma's just kind of not useless. Or not, use, not useless. It's not really useful, honestly. So, uh... Yama is capable of seeing 360 degrees without having to move its eyes. Wow. Wait, it can see behind it itself? Wow. Um. I am going to nickname this thing Ubers. Because this is far before Mega Blaze, or this is far before Blaziken, I think, got speed boost. I don't know if the hidden abilities were introduced in this gen or not, but this is before Blaziken got speed boost. And I think this is the only Pokemon that actually had speed boost, so I'm going to call him Ubers. Don't ask me why. It's a bad nickname, I know, but, you know, it's a fun nickname, too. Uh, we can't get up there unless we have a bike. Uh, let's keep looking around here. Uh, we're going to find another Pokemon that would have been amazing. That would have been absolutely amazing. So, what I actually want to do is... Switch train a little bit with uh, core on every wild Pokemon we find would be amazing if I can just switch train with them a little. So uh, I'm going to just try to find my way around here. Need a ran. Uh, I'm going to just go into Kyogre, I guess, for you. That way I don't get poison pointed. So I just, I did, I do want to level up core a little bit. Um, Alright, so I think we found something. Alright. There's only one way to go. I think, I think there's only one way to go in here. I don't think this is like a place you can actually get lost in. Yeah, I think we're fine. Look, some rock smash boulders. Look, what's up here? More rock smash boulders. Uh, that's all that's up here? Wow, I'm getting lost. I said we weren't going to get lost, and we're getting lost. I feel like I can handle this. Just for charm. I can't do this. It's not even worth Really? It's not even worth it. It's not even worth the experience, because Togepi doesn't give good experience. Oh, okay, it gives 63 experience. That's actually not bad. Uh, is there nothing up here but rock slide? Or rock boulders? Oh, my God. Okay, then. Calm down. Why is there a Venusaur in here? 
Wow, it's actually uh, it's actually female too. That's really interesting because you don't usually find female uh, starters. That's really cool. Anyway, uh, maybe I went the wrong way. Maybe I do need flash. Maybe I'm tripping. Um, I think I can kill this thing too. I think he's gonna get tackled, right? Yeah, I'm just gonna kill this. Yeah, I'm just gonna kill this. It's gonna take forever, but it's gonna die. So nice, nice and a full level from Yon Mega. Thank you so much. Yep, I went the wrong way. Gosh darn it. All right, so now I'm gonna go over here. Uh, can I get over here? Wait, I just I've completely messed up. I think I've messed up. I need to get out of here. Uh oh, wait, why? What? Oh my god. <laughs> Getting lucky. I think I've made a mistake. I think I'm lost. As I just said, you can't get lost in here. I think I've gotten lost. Um, well, this is going to get Steelix some nice levels, I guess, me getting lost. How have I done this? How have I managed to get lost? How have I actually managed to get lost in here? I feel like this is... I feel like this... You shouldn't be able to get lost in here. That's, that's so stupid. Can I please just stop getting confused? Thank you. Or learn to bind. Useful. Um, did I go do the wrong thing? Like, did I just mess up completely? I feel like I did. Maybe not. Oh, no, I think we're fine. There's an item here. Fresh water. Nice. Useful, useful, useful items. All right, so, uh, Yon Mega, I'm just going to kill you with a screech and then tackle. Don't get a crit or something on me, please. All right, cool. So, Core is just slowly but steadily catching up to the party. Uh, yeah, okay. I think I've I think I've found my way a little bit more than yeah. Okay, we're good now. Uh, are we good now? Question mark. Uh, oh, okay. Wait, I think we're fine. Ah, nice. I want to see if there's anything else in here though, like down here. Oh my gosh, I'm I hate everything. <laughs> um, I want to see if there's something down here for me. No. All right, cool. Let me get up in here. All right, so now we are almost there. I know it took forever. It's been 3,000 years, all that good stuff, but uh, we're almost done now. Uh, I wish I could have caught a Kecleon in here. That would have been amazing. I really like Kecleon a lot, so that would have been awesome. But alas, we did not catch that, so that would have been cool, though. Anyway, a Registeel. He's only going to know explosions, so that's bad. I have to find who my most offensive Mon is, which is probably Steelix. So I might just have to heal up. 42 defense, 31, 30, 25. Yep, it's Steelix. It's my uh, it's my new encounter. It's my new Pokemon. So, can we please just wait? Where's my? Oh, okay, I was about to say, where are my healing items? I know I've got some. I'm gonna go ahead and go for a. I don't need a super potion. I just need a regular potion, and hope that I live. All right, good. Yummy, eating it up. Give me all that experience, too. Nice. I can just grind on Reggie Steels in here. Uh, shift tree. I'm going to switch out into Salamence. I don't think this thing can actually hurt me. I'm going for growth. Calm down. All right, cool. I'm just trying to get core some levels here, honestly. That's the main priority. Anyway, we are here with Mr. Steven Stone. It is obviously not as uh, spectacular as... Oh, hi. Okay. Jerk. Obviously not as, spectac as, as spectacular as Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, but anyway. That device you have there, is that a Pokenap? When trainers that have Pokenaps battle, it keeps a record of how... how uh, uh, bleh. It keeps a record of how things went, I think. Oh, pardon me. My name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones. I travel here and there. Oh, a letter? For me? My British accent's probably terrible, but I, uh, yeah, I do my best. Okay, thank you. You went through all this trouble to deliver that. I, I need to thank you. You just did. <laughs> Let me see. I think I'll give you this TM. It contains my favorite move, Steel Wing. It's amazing his favorite move is in like Meteor Mash or Doom Desire. You know, Steel Wing. Your Pokemon appear quite capable. If you keep training them, you can even become the champion of the Pokemon League one day. That's what I think. Now I've got to hurry you along. Isn't it weird how like all the champions tend to say that at some point, most of them anyway? It's like you could possibly oh, you could possibly be the champion one day. Who can learn Fissure? Salamence is the only Pokemon that can learn Fissure. 
I'm not a million percent sure how one hit KO moves work in this in this gen. I could have got a Metapod in here. That would have been cool. I really like Butterfree a lot. That would have been nice. Uh, Venomoth. Wow. Um, I'm not sure how one hit KO moves work in this gen, but I feel like uh, I feel like it's like based off of your levels. I could be wrong. I've been wrong before, guys. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and heal up. I think what I'm gonna do is give Steelix the experience here, or one of them. Um. I think it's what I'm going to do. Uh, I almost tossed it. That would have been terrible. I'm going to give one to Steelix, and then I'm going to uh, just keep it off of everyone else for now. I'm also going to move Kyogre out to the front here. Um, I'm scared to take on this gym because we are pretty much un severely underleveled, but hopefully it will be okay. Um, I don't really talk to those guys. I know some people do, but I don't. Uh, Alright, so first battle. I'm scared. Grovile. Bad lead for me, but I'm going to Water Pulse anyway. How much is this going to do to me? Hurt yourself. Nice. You're dead. That was scary, uh, but I'm glad that we didn't die. I wish these people had more Pokemon, too. That sucks. I really need them to have more Pokemon than just one. That Cargo. Wow. Beautiful. Gone. Ancient Power? I got Ancient Power? Huh? Yo. They call me Coverage. Anyway, Furret comes out. I'm just going to go for a Water Pulse and kill it. Uh, Skip Loom. I can go into Chili for Skip Loom, I think. It is flying, I, I believe. It isn't. It isn't actually flying. Uh, anyway. Core gets to level 13 when Rock Throw. Nice. Laron. Uh, what do I have for a Laron? I have nothing for a Laron. I'm going to go into Tinkerbell. I'm going to go into Tinkerbell. I think we're fine to go into that. I'm going to Leech Seed. It goes for Harden, that's fine. I'm gonna go for Confusion. Uh, I know it's not gonna, it's gonna take a while to kill this thing, but I do want the experience on Tinkerbell. It's been a while since I've trained it up, so. We are gonna get the experience on Tinkerbell, our beautiful starting Pokemon. And uh, Battle Girl Tessa is gonna go down, so uh, nice. Anyway, there's Brawly, so I think there's one more trainer I can battle here. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I guess there's not, I guess that's it. All right, well, looks like we're going in. I'm gonna heal Kyogre up really quick. I'm a little nervous, like I said before. I'm pretty scared of, uh, pretty scared of Brawly. I'm gonna be honest, guys. I mean, I'm pretty, I'm pretty nervous. I think we can beat him, but uh, I'm scared. I'm definitely scared. So I didn't read his text. I'm sorry. I'm just scared, and for a good reason, apparently. Uh, I'm gonna water pulse. My special defense is really, really good. So um, use super potion. Great. Um, I'm just gonna water pulse again. I need to slow it down. I'm not gonna speed up during gym trainers or gym leaders rather rather Anyway, um water pulse See how much it does it does like at least yeah, it, it does a lot. So I think we're good Rain's gonna continue to fall. I'm gonna speed up through the rain falling because that's useless time, but uh, he's gonna heal up again I'm gonna water pulse again Uh, it does a lot. Can I get a crit please? Can I get a crit water pulse? That would be amazing Anyway, uh, can we just like focus on the fact that he has a mute? Uh oh that's not good at all. Oh, uh, so he has my moves now, right? So I am scared to switch an Electabuzz, but I think I have to. Don't kill me with Ancient Power. Okay, good. He didn't get the boost either, which is nice. So now I can just Thunder Punch and kill it, which is amazing. That's actually fine that he transformed into that. That's easier for me. He lives. He lives. I can just Quick Attack and kill it, though. Oh, my God. He lived. I was not expecting him to live that at all. That's insanity. Core is going to gain another level. Chili is not going to get a level. I didn't see what this Pokemon was. I'm going to stay in. Meryl. Okay, that's fine. Thunder Punch. Defense Curl? Please don't do that. How much is this going to do? Oh, that did so much. All right, now I can just quick attack, I think, and kill this thing. As he just uses potions on Mew. Huh? That did nothing. Oh, my God. Why did that quick attack literally heal Meryl? <laughs> All right, anyway, we are going to end up uh, beating Brawly, which is nice. I should have read his text. I feel kind of bad that I didn't. Whoa, wow. You made a much bigger splash than I expected. You swamped me. Okay, you got me. Take this gym badge. You got it, bro. I don't know if that's the voice I would have given him, but that's the voice I gave him now, so deal with it. All right. Anyway. Ah, uh, nice and knuckle badge from Brawly. Nice and knuckle badge from Brawly. Cool, cool, cool. 
The Knuckle Badge makes all Pokemon up to level 30, even those you get in trades, obey without question. And you'll be able to use the HM moves flash outside of battle. If you'd like, use the Techno Bushy too. Blah, I said technical wrong. Blah. <laughs> this is Bulk Up, right? That TM08 contains Bulk Up. It's a move that raises both attack and defense. Thanks, bro. wonder what it actually is, though. Torment. Uh, that's kind of useless. It's kind of useless. I can't run in here, so I just need to speed up through it, I guess. Anyway, we got through Brawly pretty underleveled, so... I guess that's good. I guess that's good. I'm gonna go heal up, and, uh, yeah. Make our way downtown, walking fast. I'm gonna go to Slateport. We're gonna go ahead and go. Slateport it is, eh? And goes away. Pick up. I'm not gonna say that every single time. You say it, Briny. You say it all the time. Get out of here. All right, so this is a new encounter for us. I'm gonna fish right here. I'm gonna change what Pokemon is in front first because I want Thickums up front to put whatever it is to bed. So we're gonna go ahead and find a Pokemon. See what it is. A bite. I just completely messed up and didn't press A fast enough. I was trying to fix my mic, but uh, you know how that goes. Anyway, we obviously are going to have some trouble finding a Pokemon, which is kind of annoying. Are you kidding me, Pokemon game? Come back. Wow. I'm going to go over here then. Fine. The, the Pokemon that I caught swam over here, so now I have to... Are you kidding me? What, what is this? I'm going to go fish way up here then. Oh, that's Slateport. Are we serious? Here. Thank God. Alright, our first encounter is gonna be... A Rhydon. A Ry Rhyhorn, not Rhydon. Rhydon would have been power. Rhyhorn, though, that's pretty okay. Um, I have no problem with Rhyhorn being our encounter. Um, obviously, we have Steelix, so I'm not gonna catch... Or I'm not gonna uh, use Rhyhorn uh, just yet, but... Rhyhorn's a pretty cool Pokemon to have, though. I actually don't mind getting Rhyhorn. That's pretty That's pretty cool. It's pretty neat. And we caught it right away. Wow. Um. Nice. Um. Rhyhorn's brain is very small. It's so dense. While on a run, it forgets why it started running in the first place. Wow. Wow. I'm going to name it IQ. IQ because apparently it's dumb. So I'm going to name it IQ. Good nickname, bad nickname, I don't care. Anyway, we're going to get an, our next encounter in Slateport. Please be something good. Please be something good. I would love a fire type. That would pretty much round the team out. Or a psychic type. <gasps> oh my god, we got a Magby! Oh my god. Yo, that is so awesome. We're going to have Electabuzz and a Magmar on the team? Hold on. Wait. I love Magmar so much. Can I catch you in one Pokeball? Probably not. I don't think I can actually touch this thing, though. Do I think a tackle from Steve? Yeah, it will. I can't hurt it. I can't hurt this thing. I just have to throw Pokeballs at it. I'll throw all my Pokeballs and then a Timer Ball at the end, and hopefully it'll stay in the Timer Ball. Or one of these Pokeballs. Come on, Magby. Come on, Magby. Come on, please. Please, Magby, please. I called the Fire-type, too. I said, can I please get a Fire-type? And then we did. Amazing. Yes! That is an awesome encounter. The live coal Pokemon. Magby's state of health is determined by observing the fire it breathes. If the Pokemon is spouting yellow flames from its mouth, it's in good health. When it's fatigued, black smoke will be mixed with the flames. Wow, that's a really cool Pokedex entry, too. Um, so, we have to name it Tid Duck. <laughs> out, of, out of respect for all of those Poketubers who came before me, I have to name it Tid Duck. I have to. I have to. So, we need to go check that Pokemon out, yo. 
Magby, that's an insane encounter. I'm probably going to take uh, Thickums out of the party for Magby. Thickums really helps when catching Pokemon. Um, I don't know, man. Thickums really helps when catching Pokemon. And I'm going to have to... Um, I'm going to have to... He's holding a Sunstone. Oh, wow. Um, I'm going to have to increase his happiness, too. Impish Nature. Uh, I have another Impish Nature Pokemon as well. I wonder what I wonder what Impish does now. Now I'm kind of curious. I think I've got an app on my phone that has the, the type charts. Uh, I'm pretty sure I do. Or the, uh, not the type charts, but the, um... The, uh... What's it called? The, the abilities. Not the abilities. What is it called? The natures. Oh my gosh. Gosh. I'm just losing my mind. Alright, so, anyway, Magby has Ember and Leer. That's amazing that's actually an amazing Pokemon I am truly truly happy with the Magby that's amazing it's actually amazing um what do I do guys what do I do um I want to take I want to take Thickums out of the party for Magby but then I kind of want to take Celebi as well but Celebi's our starter I can't take Celebi out what I'm gonna do is leave Magby for now, uh, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna do some grinding between episodes. I feel like, and um, I'm gonna do some grinding between episodes, and I feel like I'm just going to switch Thickums and Magby out once Magby evolves, uh, wins Max Happiness. I wish I had a Soothe Bell, <laughs> if I'm being honest, but uh, I think we're fine right now to leave Magby in there. Uh, like I said, I'm gonna do some grinding. I'm gonna go grind on. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm scared to go over there. Uh, oh, I could have fished up here, too. It doesn't matter. Anyway, um, I think I'm going to probably end the episode off. Uh, where do I go? Where do I go? What's a cool place? Is there a cool place in this town to go? Not really. That's kind of annoying. Um, there's, like, no spots that are clever or interesting to, uh, to stop. And there's just no clever spots at all. I could do it here. No clever spots in this town. Why are there no clever spots? Give me a clever spot. There we go. That's clever enough. So if you guys enjoyed the episode, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe down below if you haven't already. As well as check me out on Twitter and Twitch. Uh, we did a lot today. We got a couple of encounters. We met Steven. We did the do for town thing. And uh, yeah, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. And if you didn't, then I'm sorry. But hopefully next episode will be your cup of tea. We will have a... Uh, episode going out on Wednesday as well as our other uh, showdown content so go check the showdown stuff out as well link in the description and all that good stuff but like I said if you guys enjoyed make sure to leave a like comment and all that stuff down below and I will see you guys in the next video I'm out false alarm ladies and gentlemen we got seven minutes left so uh, we got seven minutes until 30 so what I think I'm gonna do is uh, I'm going to go in here and, and do what it does. You know, I'm going to do what it do. So I'm going to go in here and talk to this guy. I didn't realize that we were only at 23 minutes. I don't have, like, the thing going on. So, uh, yeah. Anyway, he's telling me where Captain Stern is. So I'm going to go tell him. I'm going to go talk to Captain Stern. Uh, I didn't realize that we were not, um, we were, like, 20, like, 22 minutes or 23 minutes when I did that. So, anyway, uh, <laughs> fair enough. Anyway, so, uh, we're in here now. Yeah, 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 whatever. Doesn't somebody give you Thief in here? I think, yeah, I think he does. Nice. Alright, so let me see, uh... Why did he, like, scramble out? I'm just a kid. Drill Peck! Oh, wow. I wish Salamence could learn it. Okay. Alright, I wish Salamence could learn it. That would be amazing. But, uh, I don't think anybody else does anything for you in here. Uh, I, love how, I love how they're Team Aqua, and they're, like, the evil corporation, but they're, like, so infatuated with looking at these things, and they're just like, Oh, wow, dude, look at this cool stuff in the museum. Is that the Blue Orb? I actually never noticed that. I thought, like, why do they have the blue orb in the museum? But whatever. I don't know what their ace is going to be. I'm scared. I'm going to go battle some of these people down here. I'm scared of what their ace is going to be. I'm going to be completely honest. I am terrified. So, uh, yeah. So, um, yeah. So, uh, yeah. I'm actually terrified. Hold on. I'm going to look up and see what their ace is going to be. Because if it's not bad, then I think it's going to be all right. Wait, why am I all the way in Mauville Town? Oh my lord. 
Um, I don't actually doesn't it doesn't actually say. I wish it did, but um, you know what? I think we're fine. We've got legendaries on the team. I just wasted fifty dollars. I actually wasted a hundred dollars. Let me go. Just let's do this. Yes. If you're looking for Stern, that would be me. Ha. Huh. That must be the part I ordered from Devin, Mr. Stone. Devin, uh, thank you. That's great. We can prepare our expedition now. <laughs> Not so fast, nerd. <laughs> Hold it. We'll take those parts. <laughs> what? What are you people? What are you people? What are you people? We're Team Aqua. Our boss wants those parts. Shut your yap and fork them over. I wasn't talking. Battle him. I didn't say anything. No sleep. Level 15. Oh, we're fine then. We're actually fine. Um, I'm gonna switch out though. Into BK. Burger King. That's such a bad nickname. <laughs> That's such a bad nickname. He goes for growth. Calm down, Nuzleaf. Anyway, we are gonna take down the uh, Nuzleaf. And BK is gonna get to level 16. Nice. Not bad. And, uh. Oh! <laughs> a kid beat me? Yeah. <laughs> sorry, dude. I'm sorry. My bad, bro. Oh man, what a disaster! The boss is gonna be furious! <laughs> Sniveling wimp. Let me take care of this. They, they, they all sound the same. You know? That, that makes a lot of sense, right? They all sound exactly the same. Ooh. Wow. Alright, calm down. He's not gonna have anything to hit me with. Except for like Dragon Rage. No, I, I think I said no early Dragon Rage in this game, so I'm gonna Leech Seed as well. Uh, just because I'm scared to death of this thing. I'm gonna Vine Whip too. Uh, that, does, that literally does zero, so... Thrash. Okay, Gyarados. You need to be calmed down. Please hit the sleep powder. Nice. That, that was kind of lucky that we hit that sleep powder. I'm going to be honest. But, you know, whatever. Sometimes you just got to get a little bit lucky, you know? Korg is level 15. I can take the XP share off of him. Lunatone wants to come out. Um, what do I have for a Lunatone? I guess I'm going to Kyogre. Thickums is already pretty leveled up. I really want to keep Thickums, but I really want to use Magby, and it helps the team. Core's going to get 225, so it's confirmed, and uh, we are going to beat them. Nice. Now what? If we don't get the parts, we're in for it. Arg. <laughs> I didn't count on being meddled with by some meddling kid and their stupid dog. Ruby dooby doo <laughs> I said Ruby dooby doo like he doesn't say it's, it's like Scooby. All right, whatever. I said Ruby dooby doo I'm not trying to get copyrighted, all right? Hasbro? That's not Hasbro. It's, uh, Michelle Tana something, right? I don't know what it is. Anyway. Arg! I came to see what was taking so long and stacked some parts. And your landlubbers, your simps, are held up by a mere child. Arg! I'm Team Aqua's Arg, Chi. <laughs> Tell me, what do you meddle in the noble affairs of Team Aqua? Arg. Pokemon people and all life depend on the sea. Arg, arg. So Team Aqua's dedicated to the expansion of the sea, arg, arg. Don't you arg, Gree? <laughs> oh my god. What we are doing is a magnificent undertaking, arg, 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 fine. You're still too young, arg. I can't be helped that you don't understand our ideals, arg. But if you ever oppose us again, arg, there will be consequences, arg. Heed my warning, arg, farewell, arg. <laughs> that's, that's ridiculous. You're, ah. Wait, wait, wait. That's not his voice. You're... Uh, I can't even do his voice anymore. <laughs> I did the Arg voice. You're... Uh, okay, you're Trishity. Anyway, that was a tense situation. Thanks for saving us. Oh, yes. I almost forgot that you even brought the Devin good. <laughs> Whoops. There's no time to lose. We have to... We have to... Uh, we have to set out on our ocean floor expedition really soon. Thanks, excuse me. All right, bro. You don't want to give me anything for saving you and your goods? Cool. Thanks a lot. Anyway, I think we can just end the episode off uh, right here. And I think we should be good to go now. I think that's. I think we're about 30 minutes now. Sorry about that mistake earlier, but, you know, obviously I cut it down to, uh, you know, it didn't take any time for you guys. So I'm not going to do the outro again. I already did it once. But like I said, like, subscribe, comment, check the description. You already know what to do. You know me, YouTube. It's been Nappy Boy 92 You know me. It's not actually Nappy Boy 92 <laughs> uh, But I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out.